team in Denver, like a lot of the Denver teams we've seen over the last couple of seasons. It's always fun to watch a Denver de uh, Denver's offense. Uh, Matt Brown, I think, is one of the most creative offensive coaches in the sport and uh, always has his guys moving extremely well off ball, very active. A lot of traffic coming across the front of the crease, trying to get that ball in as Miller gets it up top. And great defense, that one coming from O'Hara. Close to Mesa, California. There's Bob Zien playing the two-man game. Adamson comes around the corner, takes the shot, and again, it, you think down later in the game, with, with the depth will really be on display for both of these teams. Cannizzaro cuts across, great pass, and what a goal! That one coming from... Yeah, that's exactly right. I mean, that, we just talked about a long possession, making it tough on the defense. For Denver. I thought that might have been a pass. <laughs> There's Miller. Trying to create some space. About their high percentage of shooting and their selectivity in the shooting, but backing a ball up is uh, not getting themselves in too much trouble. See Miller. Fakes the little flip. Nice look inside. There's the shot, and what a save by Kelly. Yeah, very patient. And Adamson working from up top. Gets it to Noble. Gets it back to Adamson. Berg with some space. 15 seconds to go. 10, got to find somebody. Nice look inside to Adamson, takes the shot, finds the five. Yeah, defender draped all over him. Um, there's only so much you can do as a goaltender there. Amazing offense and uh, early in this game. The freshman out of the Hill Academy. See Adamson cutting inside, has a lane for himself, takes the shot and buries it. Toss your hats. Um, just does a nice job getting underneath. Probably like to see a little bit of help there from uh, Garrett Holst on, on Notre Dame, I believe. Um, excuse me. Uh, in a way, the alley and putting the ball on the ground. There's Adamson, again, looking for number four. As you see the slide coming very quickly. Canizaro can't find it. And Adamson coming in from behind, able to get his body in there. That's great man ball. And Denver's doing a very good job getting the ball back as Adamson coming inside. Uh, once pretty the ball. quiet after the first goal on the uh, on the day, it's been all Adamson. It's Miller back up to Noble. Noble some space finds Adamson. Adamson buries the goal. Ears were burning. That's number one. play. I think Miller finds him. Or excuse me, is it Noble? Noble. Noble finds him down low, head up, and then Adamson hands up high, takes an extra step up field, increases angle, and puts both the ball. Of these both of these goalies have played in all five games leading up to uh, leading up to today. So uh, definitely something that that. Coach Tierney goes to regularly in switching those goalies at the half. It's tough to, to, bring a, uh, to bring a goalie out who has such a hot hand, though. Yeah, that, that's got to be the challenge for him is to, uh, to just stick to that system when, when you do see a guy like LaPlante who's seeing the ball extremely well and making a lot of saves. But that's the system they're going with, and it's, it's certainly worked for them over the last, I think, two years. Archer looking for some space. Gets it to Miller back up top. Canizaro finds, finds Adamson. Adamson gets the quick double. Someone's open. Back to Archer. Archer takes the shot, and that one off the inside pipe. Clearing space. You saw how much room they gave him to dodge against a short stick, as they're doing with Adamson right now. Now Adamson takes the shot, and that's a great lift coming across from, again, Matthew Collins, one of the, uh, the, the great uh, short stick defenders for Notre Dame. I've been really impressed with the short stick defense out of both sides. Obviously, that's what everybody attacks. All the way across to uh, Adamson. Adamson takes the shot. And effort as a whole as we watch the save again. You give Adamson that kind of time and room. Um, you know, Adamson would like to have that back. Obviously, stick side high is not where he wanted to put it. She's got. It looks like he's lining up for the isolation. No question about it. Adamson creating some space. No slide there. Great short stick defense. It looks like they've got O'Hara working on uh, on Canizaro, who's been who's been really hurting them in the second half. So Adamson takes the shot, and what a goal! That's number five. Second. And it's just a subtle movement as you see him just get by his man, gets off that shoulder, and then puts it far post, top shed. Spectacular play. But right back to the Pioneers as Adamson has it. Adamson's really got to get busy if we're going to see the, the sock trick, I think, right? We need a couple more. Two more. Tyler Pace. Yeah, that's, a, uh, that's an unbelievable handle inside and, and would have been a, uh, a highlight goal if he'd put it away. Adamson draws the double, moves it to Pace with the skip pass up top to Miller. Miller looking inside, takes the shot and buries it in Berg's first. But that's great field recognition from the freshman. Yeah. There's Adamson coming from up top. Has the shorty nice. Mitty, who 
likely isn't all that comfortable on the defensive end of the ball. We'll see if Denver recognizes it. Like I said, for Cannizzaro, back up to Berg, and just like you mentioned, the matchup that they want to take advantage of, nice stick fake. Gets an odd unforced error there, but, uh, but fortunate to recover. Like that's the, uh, that's the spot where the sun is. Yeah. As Berg, nice look inside, takes the shot, buries the goal. That's number six. A, uh, a freshman offensive midi on defense uh, draws a quick double, and Adamson curls right to the ball. Again, finds that low and away corner, and uh, and just a great finish. Again, sort of uh, you referenced Kyle Harrison earlier, that sort of jump shot style finish. Um, 